Hello, my name is Sofia Lisanti and I'm a postdoctoral fellow in Dr. Dario Altieri's lab at the Worcester Institute. Our lab studies the mitochondria, which are the subcellular compartments uh, that produce most of the energy that the cell needs for their activities and which are often dysfunctional in cancer. Um, a few years ago, our lab discovered the TRAP1, a mitochondrial chaperone, is highly expressed in most uh, of tumor types. Um, a chaperone is a protein which is involved in the, assem the assembly and folding of other proteins, and this is extremely important for protein functions. Um, to find out if TRAP1 is involved in tumor formation, we therefore developed for my project um, a mouse model which completely lacks TRAP1. This is called the TRAP1 knockout mice, mouse. And we compared TRAP1 knockout mice with TRAP1 wild type mice, which have a normal level of TRAP1. What we found in this study was that TRAP1 knockout mice are healthier, they are viable, fertile, and they live at least as long as the wild type counterparts. Um, and in depth, when we went on to study their tissues, we found that there were less age-related effects, uh, such as inflammation, tissue inflammation, tissue necrosis or cell death, and uh, less tumor formation. Um, we can therefore conclude that the TRAP1 is an oncogene, that is a gene which is capable of causing cancer. And this is important because we can, use, we can target it using anti-cancer drugs. In fact, our lab has already developed a drug called Gametrony, which um, has between the targets the TRAP1 protein itself. And we believe that this could have clinical applications soon and it will have potent anti-cancer effect while having less adverse effects because TRAP1 is specifically highly expressed in most tumor cells.